Hi student, today we are going to start the next point that is a electric cell. In last period we discussed about electric current. Electric current means flow of electrons. Flow of electrons through a conductor is called as a electric current. Electric current measured in the unit called as a ampere. 1 ampere equal to 1 coulomb upon 1 second. Already we have to complete electric current. Uh, the, how the electric current produces? In a different ways, we have to uh, study in last period. Today, we have to discuss about electric cell. We know that there are different electric cell. Electric, the main function of electric cell is to maintain the potential difference between the two terminals. Potential difference means vivavantar. Vivavantar means that there are two points. 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 There are two तर त्याला आपण पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस असं म्हणताय ए आणि बी या दोन पॉइंट मध्ये इलेक्ट्रिक करंट वाहून जात असेल तर त्याला आपण पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस म्हणताय मग आता इलेक्ट्रिक सेल इलेक्ट्रिक सेल मध्ये इलेक्ट्रिक करंट हा स्टोरेज केलेला असतो त्यामध्ये पॉझिटिव नेगेटिव चार्जेस वापरलेले असतात पॉझिटिव नेगेटिव टर्मिनल्स असतात आणि हे इलेक्ट्रिक सेल वेगवेगळ्या डिव्हाइसेस मध्ये वापरले जातात फॉर एग्जांपल रिस्ट वॉचेस आपला मंगटी घड्याळ असेल वॉल वॉच असेल किंवा डिफरंट टाइप्स ऑफ टॉईज व्हिच आर वर्किंग ऑन दिस इलेक्ट्रिक सेल द रिमोट कंट्रोल द रिमोट ऑफ टीव्ही आल्सो यू इन दिस रिमोट कंट्रोल टॉईज द इलेक्ट्रिक सेल्स आर आल्सो यूज्ड सो वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट द इंफॉर्मेशन अबाउट इलेक्ट्रिक सेल लुक एट दिस इलेक्ट्रिक सेल अ सोर्स इज रिक्वायर्ड टू प्रोड्यूस a uniform flow of a charge in a circuit is called electric cell electric cell means a source which is a source is required to produce uniform flow this point is important uniform flow of a charge manje ek saman paddhatine prabhar ekhadya circuit madhe vahun jat asel ek saman paddhatine electric current vahun jat asel tar tya tya source la pan ya thane electric cell manta yil The main function of electric cell is to maintain the constant potential difference between its two terminal. Yeah, electric cell is the main function. Karya kya hai? The the main function of electric cell is to maintain. Manje thevni to maintain the potential between to maintain the potential difference between two terminals. Dilay ra do terminals manla potential difference hai constant thevni sa kam. इलेक्ट्रिक सेल करता है टुडे टुडे एवरी डे वी हैव टू सी द डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ सेल लुक एट दिस सम एग्जांपल्स ऑफ इलेक्ट्रिक सेल एज नंबर फर्स्ट ड्राई सेल एंड नंबर टू लीड एसिड सेल या दोन सेल ची माहिती आज आपण घेणार आहोत ड्राई सेल लुक एट दिस इट इज अ ड्राई सेल दिस सेल इज यूज्ड इन अ रिस्ट दिस सेल इज यूज्ड इन अ टॉईज डिफरेंट टॉईज आल्सो वॉल वॉच ऑल्सो रिमोट कंट्रोल रिमोट कंट्रोल असेल किंवा भिंतीवरचा घड्याळ असेल किंवा वेगवेगळ्या प्रकारचे टॉईज असतील त्यामध्ये अशा प्रकारचा ड्राय सेल वापरला जातो याला कोरडा विद्युत घट असं म्हणता येईल आता यामध्ये द ड्राय सेल कन्सिस्ट ऑफ टू टर्मिनल्स पॉझिटिव्ह अँड निगेटिव्ह हे जर आपण पाहिलं तर याला प्लस आणि मायनस साईन आहे पॉझिटिव्ह अँड निगेटिव्ह टर्मिनल्स आर ऑल्सो प्रेझेंट इन अ ड्राय सेल देर इज अ रॉड देर इज Inside the uh, dry cell, there is a graphite rod which carries the electric current from one point to another point, from positive direction to a negative direction. यह मध्य graphite rod है या dry cell में दे या graphite rod से काम का है तो electric current हाँ वहूं नहीं ना से काम या dry cell से है या graphite से संत है। The diagram of a dry cell is as look at this. Which are the components? Which are the chemicals are present in a dry cell? नंबर फर्स्ट झिंक मेटल लेयर व्हेन वी हैव टू ब्रेक द दिस ड्राई सेल वी हैव टू सी द डिफरेंट सबस्टेंसेस आर डिफरेंट केमिकल्स आर प्रेजेंट इन अ ड्राई सेल लुक एट दिस दिस आउटर लेयर व्हिच इज मेड अप ऑफ झिंक इट इज अ झिंक लेयर ऑफ अ ड्राई सेल इट इज आउटर लेयर ऑफ अ ड्राई सेल इनसाइड देयर इज अ पल्प ऑफ पल्प ऑफ अ झिंक क्लोराइड एंड अमोनियम क्लोराइड 
there is a pulp of zinc chloride and ammonium chloride also magnesium dioxide which is present inside the dry cell so in a dry cell different chemicals are present the outer layer of a dry cell is made up of zinc the inner part of a inner middle part of a dry cell is a graphite graphite is a rod just as look at this it is a graphite rod which is present in a dry cell Dra graphite rod is present at the center of the dry cell and <coughs> besides surrounding to the graphite rod there is a um, zinc zinc metal layer carbon electron is present then magnesium dioxide the weight pulp of zinc chloride and ammonium chloride is also present zinc chloride and ammonium chloride of weight pulp to it is important uh, for uh, for the slow chemical reactions a uh, continuous constant electric current flow in a dry cell dry cell is a very important it is very convenient to use we have to use anywhere uh, we, this cell is used in a radio also this cell is used in a different devices so dry cell is important cell for a human being in a different devices we have to use them. so in a dry cell these are the chemical substances are uh, in order zinc metal layer zinc chloride ammonium chloride graphite rod which carry the positive and negative charge which flow the uh, which flow the electric current graphite is a good conductor of electricity so in a dry cell the center part in a, in the middle part of a dry cell there is a rod the rod which is known as a graphite rod in a graphite rod having a upper part is having a positive terminal and lower part is a negative terminal so dry cell is important to flow the electric current in a different devices next cell electric cell we have to study that is a lead acid cell in a lead acid cell uh, uh, two different uh, two different uh, chemicals are used uh, uh, in a dry in a lead acid cell in a battery there is a liquid which is a concentrate s2so4 sulfuric acid which acts as a electrolyte and two rods are dipped in a s2so4 or sulfuric acid the two rods are positive and negative rods are the positive rod containing the lead dioxide lead dioxide pdo2 and negative rod which is a lead means the chemical reaction take place in a lead acid cell yeah, these two rods are dipped in the electrolyte in the solution of a sulfuric acid s2so4 which is a sulfuric acid which is used as a electrolyte and the potential difference between two terminal is a two volt look at this two volt is a potential difference between positive terminal to a negative terminal this lead acid cell is recharged again and again when it is discharged dry cell is not recharged again and again lakshat kya ha farak ahe dry cell ha korda vidur gat yechi power samli ki ha aplya phekun dyava lagto lakshat kya but lead acid cell we have to be recharged again and again when it is discharged ha ehi battery ya battery mhanje je cell ahe lead acid cell he jara cell डिस्चार्ज झाले तर पुन्हा आपण रिचार्ज करू शकतो पुन्हा त्याला चार्जिंग या ठिकाणी करता येते दिस लीड एसिड सेल हॅज डिलिव्हर द लार्ज करंट इन अ डिवाइसेस मोठ्या प्रमाणात इलेक्ट्रिक करंट मिळवण्यासाठी या लीड एसिड सेलचा वापर होतो दिस लीड एसिड सेल व्हिच इज यूज इन कार्स ट्रक्स मोटरसायकल एंड यूपीएस दीज आर द डिवाइसेस दीज आर द इक्विपमेंट these are the equipment in which the lead acid cells are used ya prakar cha upkarana madhe kiwa ya prakar cha vahana madhe ha lead acid cell vaparla jato car car madhe pramukhyane battery cha surupa madhe lead acid cell vapartat truck asel motorcycle asel kiwa ups asel ya prakar cha vegla vahana madhe ya lead acid cell cha vapar hoto lead acid cell is a rechargeable और रिचार्ज अगेन एंड अगेन व्हेन इट इज डिस्चार्ज राहिलेला जो भाग असेल तो आपण नंतरच्या तासामध्ये पूर्ण करू